What is our purpose? Do we belong to something bigger than we can ever imagine? Are we just a random anomaly in the fabric of time and space? We are more than just molecules made by some predestined order caused to fuse together and make our mortal shell. We are special beings made of the very light of the universe. From humanity's earlier beginnings, we went from solitary lives to a desire to live in big groups. It was like our DNA knew we needed one another. Our species, whether you believe it was by natural selection or by a force we do not yet understand, developed a brain that eventually would give us self-awareness. This changed our view of our world. At first, we were mystified by the wonders of our small planet. We were connected to everything around us and nature gave us everything we needed to survive. Our world became bigger and we began our quest for knowledge to find answers for the reason of our existence. One day, something changed in our evolutionary path. We became smarter, but with this gift, we became warlike, selfish, and petty. We took for granted that we are an anomaly, which is very rare in our universe. This change made us ignore our true purpose. We began to create separatism based on minor genetic differences. Our genetic differences are part of the universe's natural order. In essence, we could not all be the same genetically for our species to evolve. Everything has an order or purpose in our reality. Individuality is important, but humanity has changed this natural order and has become corrupted by fear, indifference, greed, and bigotry. This has led to a delay in humanity reaching its true potential. Imagine the wonders we could achieve if we truly followed our purpose of existence. War, hunger, diseases, and the atrocities many cultures have committed against other human beings would have never existed. We are meant for so much more. Our achievements could be limitless. We should be dedicating ourselves to cultivate human culture, not the ideals that separate us. Could it be the reason we are alone in this infinite universe is because humanity does not truly have a common goal. History has proven only when we are faced with a common threat, we become united and we forget our differences. There is so much we are taking for granted. For all we know, we may truly be alone in this universe. But what if we are not? We could be missing the window to our true evolutionary path. What must happen to put us back on our true path? Will it be a cataclysmic event that affects every single being on our planet? Or is it just as simple as finding the answers within ourselves? We must first accept that something is truly wrong with humanity. If you have ever failed, for no particular reason, something is missing, this might be the clue to understand that we are everything connected by the infinite strings of space and time. We are still a young race in the grand scale of things. Earth is just a speck of dust that could be wiped away in an instant. But there is still hope for humanity. We can begin a new world filled with amazing wonders where anything is possible. No other species has as much potential as the human race. Our future seems so bright, but for us to reach across the stars, we must first return to our true path of evolution. To evolve, at least to us, should always be to become better human beings. Our story is the story of the universe. 
every piece of everyone, everything you love, everything you hate, and the thing you hold most precious, was assembled by the forces of nature in the first few minutes of the life of the universe, transformed in the hearts of stars, or created in their fiery deaths. And when you die, those pieces will be returned to the universe in the endless cycle of death and rebirth. What a wonderful thing it is to be part of that universe. And what a story. What a majestic story.